Hello, Sagis. Let's do your reading. So I keep getting emails to continue weekly. So I'm going to do that the best that I can. Um, we're going to ask what's coming towards you, what you'll be facing, dealing with, uh, and how to deal with it the best. Um, also, we're going to ask about your soulmates, whoever it is you thinking of while watching this video, whether you're currently in touch with them or not. Most of you are not in touch with this person. Um, we're going to ask what's coming towards them, what they're dealing with in their life that you are allowed to see for your highest good. And of course, we're going to ask how your soulmate currently relates to you, especially emotionally. So let's do this. Universe, please step in. You're very clear and important messages for the sign of Sagittarius. For Sagittarius, highest good, please. Universe, what is coming towards Sagittarius? What will Sagittarius be facing and dealing with? This is going to be extra. I'm feeling this one. Four of Wands. Your main concern is your family. There's also a lot of disagreements around you. Uh, chaotic energy uh, surrounding you. Your main concern right now is your loved ones. How they doing? Um, wow. So the, there's a lot of people around that are... Oof. What is this? Devil energy. Wow, there's a lot of chaos going on around you. People disagreeing, panicking, chaotic energy. With the devil, is not good energy. Angry words, lies. Um, wow, somebody is not happy. Let me see the extra. But nevertheless, you have a lot of passion for life. You're showing here as... Passionate, determined. Let's see clarification. Universe, please clarify these energies for Sagittarius, please. What is Sagittarius dealing with, facing? What is coming towards Sagittarius? Yeah, you're very concerned about your family. You're being very wise, strategic. Uh, you are analytical. Um... You are trying to figure out the best way to proceed uh, to take care of your family, your loved ones, to make sure they're safe. You are very passionate. You're not allowing people's panic, other people's panic to affect you in a negative way. Yeah, you're doing very well for yourself. The devil. So there's a lot of lies being spread that's affecting people negatively and the people are becoming chaotic disoriented nervous upset scared fearful all that energy showing up here very toxic chaotic energy of five of swords the devil so you are trying to figure out the best way to proceed uh with your family, your loved ones. So your main concern right now is you your well your best um your well being and your family's well being, whoever it is that you're thinking of. Uh yeah, you see, this is around the world events, the world card showing up here. Some of you may be dealing with airy um uh, Taurus and some of you may be dealing with Leo. Uh, the world card showing up on five of swords. So this is something that's affecting everybody around the globe. There's a lot of chaos, confusion going on. You are concentrating on your finances, your money, and you're doing well for yourself. So you, wherever it is you're working, whether it's for yourself or somebody else, uh, people look at you as somebody who is wise, uh, making wise decisions, uh, people look up to you. They see you as diligent worker. Yeah, a lot of chaos uh, going on around you. People fighting, disagreeing, confused, fearful. But nevertheless, you showing up here as using your wisdom. You're not allowing people to confuse you with their panic, their fear. 
their negativity. Wow, so there's a lot of spying going on. People are being spied on. Ooh, a lot of deception, but that deception will be uncovered because the Seven of Swords showed up upside down. Uh, so the lies will be revealed. Yeah, the liars will be revealed and the lies will be revealed. Uh, whether it's in your personal life or uh, on a more collective level, the lies will be revealed and so will the liars. One of the universal laws is that the truth will always come to the light. So truth will always be exposed. Lies will always come out. And the liars will always come out as well. So, yeah. Let's see your soulmate. Whoever it is you're thinking of. Uh, your soulmate did not show up in your energy just now. So let's see what's going on with them. Universe, please step in. Your main concern showed up as your well-being, your loved one's well-being, world events, and you being cool and collective and wise. Let's see, universe, please step in your very clear and important messages for the sign of Sagittarius, for Sagittarius' highest good, please. This is going to be extra. Universe, what is the soulmate of Sagittarius' dealing with uh, no matter what sign the soulmate is what is the soulmate of Sagittarius dealing with what's happening with the soulmate of Sagittarius and how is the soulmate of Sagittarius currently towards Sagittarius relating to Sagittarius at this time especially emotionally six of swords so they've been through a lot uh, stress, chaos. They see the truth. They know something is... They know the truth. Uh, this person knows the truth of whatever it is that's concerning them that they find difficult uh, because they can see clearly and see what the truth really is. They are able to move past it. Yeah, you see? Look at this. So this person is perceptive. There are some lies being spread around them, but they're able to discern everything, know what the truth is and what lies are. Yeah, they're just trying to figure out what choices they need to make for their own good. All this is swords. They're using their logic. So their main concern is what's going on around them. Um, let's see the extra. Beautiful. So ha some of you may be dealing with a cancer person, Cancerian. Uh, this is victorious energy. This person is very perceptive and is using logic to discern and find out what the lies are and what the truth is. And they are able to do that. Now they're trying to figure out what choices they need to make for their own good. Whatever it is that's going on, whether it's their personal life or more collective. Yeah, you, you're you dealing with somebody who has wisdom. Uh, showing up here as Taurus. Could be any sign, but uh, Hierophant represents Taurus. Um, magician, uh, also representing Virgo and Gemini. Two of Pentacles. So some of you, and also Gemini with the lovers, some of you are dealing with a person who is either getting divorced or got divorced uh, and is trying to move on with their life without the spouse, uh, whether you were the spouse or somebody else is their spouse. This also shows somebody, whether it was you or them, is trying to find, to is trying to hide money. Uh, yeah, so if some of you are going through um, divorce proceedings, uh, this person is, whether this person is divorced from you or from somebody else or is divorcing from somebody else, there is some money trying to be hidden 
from them. Uh, you look, they're moving on with with the life. So a lot of you or a lot of them are getting divorced or got divorced and are trying to move on, move on with the life. Judgment, yeah. So they see clearly the BS around them uh, in their personal life and collectively speaking around them. Pisces energy, the world again. So the, this person is perceptive. They can see what's going on that's affecting people worldwide. They can see what's going on and what they need to do to take care of themselves. This showed a lot of chaotic energy here, but this person is aware. So if they were in a crazy marriage where the spouse was cheating, they able to see through all the bullshit, lies, deception, manipulation. They very, they're going to be very victorious because they are wise and are able to see through everyone's bullshit and lies and deception. This person is moving on with their life, healing from heartbreak. So a lot of them got divorced or are getting divorced due to their spouse being uh, a liar and a cheater. Yeah. Yeah, they said. So some of them got divorced from you. Uh, they very sad. They keep reminiscing of the good times the two of you had. Uh, nevertheless, uh, they are sad. Yeah. So there was a divorce for a lot of them, whether it was from you or somebody else. They're moving on with their life. they healing the heartbreak. That's what shows here. Their main things, the main things that showed up in their energy field is them healing their heart from heartbreak, moving on with their life. They know they deserve better than the BS they've been through. And also they can discern very wisely the worldwide events that showed up. They can see what's going on and what the actual truth really is. So you're dealing with somebody who is wise. Uh, yeah, no matter what time they are. Let's see your extended reading we're going to go into will be your soulmate's current true long-term intentions and plans for you. Anything they may be hiding from you, whether on purpose or they don't think you care to know, but the universe feels you need to be aware of at this time for your highest good. And at the very end, we're going to ask advice for you uh, from universe and spirit on how to best handle whatever is going on around you and uh, this soulmate situation, which is important, obviously. Uh, I just saw King of Wands on the bottom of the deck. So... You dealing? You may be dealing with the fire sign. Uh, if not, you're dealing with somebody who's taking control of their life. Action. Yeah. Very wise. Hey, look at this. Queen of Swords underneath and Three of Swords. So this person has been through a lot of heartbreak uh, due to other person's uh, carelessness and inconsideration. So... Uh, yeah, they're moving on with their life. So let's see. Uh, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below. And I'll see you there, Sagis. Thank you so much.